Hi, welcome back to the Camper Tales. Usually our videos are fun and lighthearted, but today we're gonna have to keep it real with you. We have been living in this bad boy for about five months now, and after further review, we have come up with a pros and cons list that we want to share with you. So let's go. So a big one is the warranty. We haven't had to use this much yet, uh, but hopefully when we get back to our home and we take it in to do warranty work, all of the cons that we have will be fixed. So then it'll be pros all the way around. But that was a big thing for why we bought new was the warranty that you get on something new. Okay, the other pros all kind of go together. Uh, I really enjoy how many windows there are in here. It really makes it feel more open and who doesn't love sunshine? Uh, and then the other thing is the layout and like the kitchen. Like I love the white cabinets. I love the black appliances. Like it all flows really, really nice together. So that's something that I love. And really it's just the main thing that I absolutely love is the whole room for the dogs and the little cute kitten. But those are some of the pros um, about our beautiful Jayco camper. Now let's talk about the cons. Okay, to start off our cons list, this cabinet and this drives Lauren nuts. It's not flush right here. Over here, let me just show you. This, okay, flush, can't get that over there. This, not flush. That, what is that? Um, I have looked at this to try to maybe put a screw in there and tighten it up, but part of the con is if I start messing with things, there is the potential that it could void the warranty, and then it's just gonna stay like this. So, that's con number one. Next up on our cons list is uh, the paneling in the bedroom. Another craftsmanship error, but uh, let me show you. So this wall paneling um, popped apart and we took it in um, to the dealership where we bought it for warranty work and they just put staples and didn't cover the staples up. And if I'm being completely honest, um, I'm not very impressed with this, so we will not be taking it back to said dealership. Um, we'll be finding someone else to do the other warranty work, but this was, this is a con. Next up on our cons list is this couch. It is fine as a couch, but it does fall into a bed and it is the most uncomfortable thing I have ever slept on. Um, it just, we're never gonna use this as a bed. Then, our dinette also turns into a bed, and that is a whole other issue because the cushions don't line up to make a bed. They're, they're wonky. And uh, so we don't, we're never gonna turn that into a bed either. Um, so these could be a little bit better, but it's a camper. Okay, so that is our pros and cons list. Um, so far, I'm sure as time goes on, we'll find more things that we love, more things that we don't, um, and things that maybe could just be better. But all in all, we love our camper. It's great. It is exactly what we wanted, and it fits all of our needs. The craftsmanship could just be a little bit better. But what do you do? Till next time, happy travels.